What's up, ladies and all of my little gentlemen, if you are out there, welcome to Nails and Cocktails. So today, y'all, your girl is missing a few press-on nails, so we have three nails to fix. So why not sit down with your girl, grab you a cocktail, if you like press-on nails, babes. I love, love, love press-on nails, and I love having my own in-home press-on nail studio. So y'all know your girl got a cocktail, cocktail, cocktail for you. Babes, this is the Memphis Giant Beer made by the Memphis Brewing Company. Listen, if you like a good beer, ladies, you want to get this right here. Support Memphis. And if you from Memphis, you know what a junt is. Girl, I love this junt. Welcome to the Press On Nail Studio, babe. This junt is, you know, you know, put your word in there. This junt is fun. This junt, see, a junt could be a person too. It could be a girl. So you probably like that junt right there. She crazy. That junt crazy. That junt so extra. I love that junt. Whatever. A junt could be uh, some shoes. You be like, man, them junts right there. Man, them new Jordans. Man, them junts right there. So fine. You already know it's a Memphis thing. So y'all grab you a cocktail, sit down with your girl. And if you're sipping something right now while you're watching me, let me know what you're sipping down below, girl. What is your cocktail? So, mm. oh, girl, got a little, got a little fuzzy right there because I was shaking it up and being the extra brunetta that I am. Cheers, babe. Pow. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Now this is for my country girls. I know you like that beer. Oh my goodness, y'all, that is so good. It is such a good quality beer. 4.5% alcohol, 4.5% alcohol, babes. Oh, that is so delicious. All right, so let's do some nails. Y'all, I love beer. I'm that country girl. I like uh, Corona. I like the new Corona margarita things that they got. They got one that's really good. I'm going to have to... Um, List it down below. I just had it on my vacation. Ladies, it was amazing. Um, I like Yingling. I like Dos Equis. I love Blue Moon, but I don't think I can do Blue Moon because of the wheat that it's made with. But if you like a good beer, Blue Moon is a really good beer. Um, maybe one time we're going to have like, we're going to line up like six or seven different beers, y'all. We're going to have a beer tasted right here on Nails and Cocktails. Ladies, take care of yourself. Girl, I like press on nails and because it just makes me feel good. And sometimes, ladies, don't it just make your hands look better? You be like, dang, that, that oh, makes my hand look so much better. Makes you feel good when you take care of yourself. I wanted my press on nail studio because I got tired of paying all that money for those acrylic nails when you would break one, babes. That'd be like five or six dollars to fix. And don't dare try to get a design, girl. That's another six to ten dollars. So you sixteen dollars for one nail. Uh-uh. Nope. I can take that money. I can invest that money. I can save that money. And so I was like, let me try press on nails. I started with the box press on nails, babes. I'm gonna pull out of my boxes. Y'all know I have a girl that's doing over here. I started with the box press on nails, like uh kiss and uh, some other brands that I can't think of right now. They were a little flimsy, so then I started to go online on eBay, babes, and find all these different types of press-on nails. Your girl keeps some press-on nails. Your girl loves to have a lot of different uh, styles to work from, so I do have a collection of over uh, about 7,000 press-on nails. And babes, it's the cheaper way. And I get to make them myself. And anytime I break one, girl, it don't cost me nothing but like three cents. Okay. Nails and cocktails. I hope you're having a great day, sis. I hope today was a productive day for you. I hope that it was a peaceful day. Listen, don't let nobody, you know, ruin your mood. Um, you control your own mood, your own feelings. And uh, when you let people make you mad or get you upset, you give them your power. Girl, don't give nobody your power. Not even those stupid co-workers, girl, that's getting on your nerves. No, think about leveling up, you know, going for a higher position or promotion or start your own business. Mm -mm -mm. That is so good. That is so good. All right, let's fix these nails. Oh my goodness. Babes, I've been wearing press-on nails now for almost 
uh, two to three years. I am so glad that I am so, so glad that I uh, switched because baby, it's been saving me so much money. And I just love the way my nails look. They look so much better. And I get to do them the way I want to do them. Make them funky. Make a cute little funky set. I know I need two pinkies. Oh, I'm probably going to put this one over there. I like to get them set up. I got a little splish splash going on over there. I could probably put that there. No, 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 no. I'm putting that there. <laughs> yes, yes, yes. What are some of your favorite nail polish brands? If you have any type of nail polish brands or places that you like to get your nail uh Press on nail supplies. I want you to list them down below. I would love to know where I can get some uh, beautiful jewels and diamonds and things like that, babes, to add to my collection. I'm looking for a pinky. A pinky. Oh, I got a pinky. My daughter did this pinky. Um, so one, two, three. All right. There we go. Babes, you know what I'm using. Oh. My favorite, my favorite, my favorite. If I'm not like too active and doing some type of craft or getting all country like I do because I like to do little different stuff, my press-on nails can last about four weeks. This is my favorite press-on nails glue, babes. This is from the Dollar Tree. They come in a pack, two for a dollar. The best nail glue. All right. And... You don't want to put too much nail glue. If you put too much nail glue, you're going to notice that around the edges of your nails, they're going to have this like, I don't even think there's no nail glue in there, y'all. I done towed it up. Let me grab one from over here, babes. You don't want to put too much nail glue. If you do, babes, it is going to look ashy and white around your nails. So you wanna make sure you're not putting a lot of nail glue. You don't need that much. You just need to cover the entire nail. All right. right now, I think I need a freaking stick pen. I said I was gonna keep some thumbtacks in here. There should have been one up here, but it is not. Let's see, can I get some nail glue out of here? Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. This might be the task right here when your nail glue gets clogged up, babes. But if you keep a thumbtack, let me grab a thumbtack. Keep a thumbtack nearby. Bam, bam, bam. We got one. It will be so much better. Now the nail glue, you may have to like whirl it, twirl it around a little bit. Should come out a little better, All right? And I'm going to put the blue one over here, babes. Come on. Come on. Is this like not every girl's problem <laughs> that wears press-on nails? I'm trying to get the freaking nail glue unclogged. Now I'm going to I'm gonna squeeze it out of here first. Come on. I hear you in there. Oh my goodness. And this is the one that I want to use. I don't know if I have another bottle down below. Come on, baby. Come on. See, this is something next time I'm going to do off camera <laughs> to make sure it's not unclogged. Okay, so that one is having a hissy fit. I'm going to go with the Kiss Super Bond glue. This is my second favorite. I'm using the pink one. I had a purple one in front of me. So I'm using the pink one here. Let's see. This one may be <laughs> you gotta be kidding me. Like this is not the day. <laughs> this is not the day. Real talk. This is the day. Like nothing nothing's in there that needs to go. There's something in here. It's what I want to use but it's clogged up. Something in there, but you can't get it out. Let's try this one. Oh my God, are you kidding me? This is insane. All right, let's poke this one. What? We gotta poke, we gotta poke. What are we doing? 
All right, here we go, here we go. Here we go. Whoa, 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 whoa. That's what I'm talking about, like, not too much nail glue. And then guess what you girl get? Glue coming out the wazoo. All right, we don't need that. Ooh, I see it. Remember, you don't want too much. And if you get some on the edges, babes, real quick, and, and one of the things with personal nails is making sure that it's lined up and that it's straight, girl, because you don't want to have that crooked finger, darling. Yes, yes, and I like to blow. It's my favorite. Wait, all right, so keep that cough nearby, babes, and wipe around any extra nail glue that you see. Now, after you put this nail on, there's gonna be like some ashy nail glue. I mean, you're gonna feel it. It's gonna be sticky. It's gonna feel like dry glue on your hands. All you need to do is take your fingernail file babes and just foul that off. You can put a little oil on top and just foul that off. But the key to making them last is a good nail glue. The one I would have preferred would have been this one. I actually see something in there. I'm not going to throw that away. Let me just put my tops on them. I'm going to get them situated because, girl, that is the one that I love to use. So I'm going to make sure these are ready to go when your girl, because your girl is going to be needing, you know, to take this with me in my press on nails kit. All right, so now let's go to the other pinky. And when I put my press on nails, y'all, I like to work from pinky to thumb. I saw somebody do it that way, and I was like, you know what? Let me try that. That seems to be better. It is the best way to put on your press on nails. Work your way backwards, both hands, pinky to thumb. So much better. Make sure it's straight, babes. Mm, mm, mm. It's got to be straight, babes. Mm, mm, mm. When you feel like you got it straight. You don't have to blow. If you had like a little fan, that would work too. I'm thinking about adding some of those to the studio. Just some little fans that'll blow it dry. Um, it definitely would work. All right, so I saw a little nail glue. Cocktail time. Mm, 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 mm. Time to sip, babe. All right, and we got one more right here. And before I do uh, put any press on nail or any glue, I always put a base coat of uh, protector, such as calcium, a stronger nail, the blue diamond. I put like one to three coats and then I put my nails on and it protects the nail from uh, splitting. And sometimes the glue gets on like your skin right after your nail. And if you put that nail polish on there and you let it completely dry, it will change the game for your press on nails and for your nails. Oh snap, better, some of my jewels just like <clears throat> popped off. I'm looking for a better jewel glue, something that can really make my jewels stay. Like I just lost, I just lost two jewels, just that quick, just that quick. Just by pressing on the derm press on nail. I hate when that happens. Make sure if you're selling your press on nails, babes, that you have a good jewel glue because your customers are going to be upset if they put that press on nail on and those uh, jewels and trinkets just fall off. So if you know of a good jewel uh, or gem glue or um, something adhesive for the jewels, comment down below and let me know, babes, because I really want to get something better before I launch my press on nails business. And there you have it, babes. Now we got us a set. And what I'm going to do now is I'm going to foul off this glue because I can see where I got glue in certain spots from touching certain nails. And Bambino. I'm going to go in with my cuticle oil. I do this after every application of press on nails it helps my nails it does not make them um pop up it's actually growing my nails so this is just what i do babes do what 
you know works for you. I know some people's gonna say, oh, I don't like that, it don't work. Okay, if you don't like it, don't use it. But it works for me, so I love it. And now, babes, we have a new set of beautiful Brisson nails. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And I love it, babes. I do. I can just come in here anytime and do my nails. This is what me and my daughter do. We come in here and we make nails. <laughs> we fix nails. We do our own manicures up in here. Um, I haven't figured out how like to really get it done the right way. So I'm not shooting a video, babes, to show y'all how to do a manicure. I don't I don't have any tips right uh just yet, but you guys, you know you can just look on YouTube. Somebody out there, they knows how to do a good manicure. Save you some money, baby. <sighs> yes. And then we have the babes. Ow! Your girl is back, 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 back. We have us a new press on nail set. I am happy. I love it. I love it. I love it. I love it. Right here in the press on nail studio with your girl nails and cocktails. Welcome, babe. If you are new, y'all know what to do. Hit that like button for your girl. Join me right here on Nails and Cocktails. Babes, I want to come to your city. I want to come to your city. I want us to sit down and I want us to do Nails and Cocktails. B-Y-O-B, bring your own bottle. B-Y-O-N, bring your own nails and bring your own nail polish, y'all. And we're going to sit down. We're going to bring jewels and gems and stickers. And we're just going to sit down and we're going to make some sets of press on nails. Have us some cocktails and everybody can leave with their their own custom box of random designs made by everybody in the room just picking some nails and taking them home and filling up your box babes so if y'all are interested in that i want y'all to comment down below i'm gonna get something set up for your uh for you girls i'm gonna get something set up and we can sit down and have some nails and cocktails love you babes to the loo i gotta finish my beer